Shit! You know, script. Script, shot list, camera, edit. Four things, four steps, that's all I need. And with the crew, I don't have a crew. Equipment, budget. Okay, let's, let's start from the top. Four steps, script. Script, 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 script. This movie will require dinosaurs. Eric Williams, process, struggling screenwriter. Okay, okay. To average park in an Amer average neighborhood. There's a baseball field in one corner, a basketball court in another, and a bunch of Mexicans playing soccer in the middle. Suddenly it gets very dark, almost as if something is blocking the sun. All the Mexicans stop playing soccer and look up in awe. It's aliens. Interior, my subconscious. There are mozzarella sticks everywhere. What the f- This is so stupid. It's actually so stupid. Who is C.W. Neal? What should I do? I need a script. If you don't have a script, I can't record. If I don't have a script, no camera, no editing, no video. Ideas, ideas, ideas. It's always ideas. Ideas. A singing monkey. Sing. An eminent threat. Superheroes. You have DC, you have Marvel. Cooking, you have YouTube. Everything's already been made. If you want an ethnic idea, you have a CSUN thesis, a radical idea, an underfunded indie film. Music, music video. If it's been thought of, it's been done. If it's been done, it's unoriginal. Everything starts with a script. Or everything starts with an idea and then moves to a script. This, that, he, she, they, them, words, identities, who, what, where, when, how, why, who are you, what do you want to show, why do you want to create, questions, answers, question, answer, question, and answer. It's all so rigid, just so tightly packed, constructed, just doesn't seem natural. What was that play? Ideation. Ideation was great in many ways. Ideation is the combination of two words, ideas and creation. Ideas and creation is ideas, thinking, thoughts. They're all related. Flow, concept, words on top of words. And to do what? To describe more words. And that's a very bleak way of putting it. Why do we need words to describe words? Why do all our interpretations need to be the same? Why does something I think and I perceive have to be the same way as someone else perceives it? Can they not be different? Maybe the author didn't think of it this way when, and we were reading into it too much. Like, 
I'm sure Ray Bradbury did not want people dissecting his book in every single high school classroom or every single English classroom. Creators create to create. They want a response. They want to give a story and get a response. Feedback, criticism, it's always about a story. And a story leads us back to our script. It's always been a flow. Start somewhere, end somewhere else. Sometimes it's the journey, sometimes it's the destination. Sometimes it's happy, sometimes it's not. And, and that's okay. It doesn't have to be happy. It doesn't have to have an ending. It doesn't have to have a beginning. You just need a place for your audience to really take hold of. Maybe it's progression. It could even be regression. It could be front, back, left, right, up, down. Are we limited by direction? If we don't know a direction, does that mean we can't go there? Are we restricted by these unseen walls? There are so many ways, different ways to express and so many different topics to uncover. German Expressionism, Russian Montage, Silent Film, Italian Neorealism, French New Wave, Gangster Pictures, Japanese Home Life. It goes on and on. What if we combine Hispanic Home Life with a Russian Montage? Like, how would that turn out? I don't know. So many greats scattered across filmmaking history, and so many more that go unnoticed. While the obstacles are there, and gatekeeping still exists, it certainly makes things harder, but not impossible. Well now, I've got my script idea. What about yours?